¿Cómo estás? En este fragmento de la charla que tuve con Aaron Ross les pregunto sobre cómo ve el futuro de Predictable Revenue de acá a los 5, 10 años y más allá de la respuesta que te imaginas que puede dar me da, un element, me da una respuesta enfocada en lo que es el elemento humano pero no solo el elemento humano es decir personalizar los mails sino cómo encarar el trabajo de los vendedores y los SDRs en los próximos 5 o 10 años a mí me sorprendió, espero que a vos te sorprenda también I think there's part of it's obvious and there's going to be more noise. So you need to be more targeted, more relevant, more of the same. Right? There's more apps sending more email, more LinkedIn. So that's not going to change. You just have to get better. Um, you know, I, one of the things I'm working on is it is different. Like it's the idea of, around outbound, but not using cold email. So uh, we'll have to, have to see how that goes. And I'm not sure when I'll, I'll do it. Um, the world's just going to get noisier. So I think that what I see, what I'm focused on, is how to bring more of a, that human element, human energy, sales energy. It's like how do you keep people's um, excitement up? How do you help them feel good about work? And so that they feel better and more energized to be better at their jobs. And sales and sales people, sales, they're dragging. It's just working, trying to work the same job remotely and the world's changing. It's just, uh, it's just not, I don't feel like, I feel like something has to change for like our humanity to be, to just for our basic humanity and to be able to make money and get results. Like the way we're doing it. And I just feel like it's over time, it's, it's not going to work. Like the 40 hours, you know, just kind of grinding through. It has, it's, it's going to continue to, the effectiveness is going to go down. We need a new way to think about how people should be working at work, which the pandemic has created a big opportunity, right? We're kind of able to relook at how work should work, like throw away or all the old patterns and habits around like nine to five, five days a week in, a, in an office. And for some people, that's great, but other people, it's not. And we can kind of, it's confusing because we have this blank sheet of paper, like, how do we want to work? I don't know. Like, we got to try stuff. Like, I don't know. So it's confusing, but it'll end up being a much better for our, our people, which means it'll be much better for them to be able to be effective and adapt to the changes that are coming. So I, I really feel like because of the future, we, the executives especially need to be, Eve, they double down on understanding who their employees are how they're doing personally, professionally, what they need and how you can, as a company, kind of change things around to support them emotionally too. Like it's uh, really emotionally because that's an energetically, so they feel like they um, aren't exhausted at work. Sure. So I think that is actually, that's what I'm most focused on right now. Bueno, espero que te haya servido el fragmento de esta charla. Si querés ver la charla completa, ahora al final te va a aparecer un link para acceder. También te invito a que te suscribas a mi canal, Primera Reunión, donde vas a poder encontrar las diferentes entrevistas o diferentes charlas con profesionales eh, que están encarando procesos, eh, estructurando procesos de venta B2B. Eh, y a su vez, en mi sitio, primerareunión.com, también vas a poder encontrar más contenido, eh, incluyendo una charla, por ejemplo, con Aaron Ross, eh, el autor de Predictable Revenue. Bueno, espero que te haya servido.